When Jesus was hanging upon the cross for the sins of the people that were yelling obscenities at him, he had the power and the authority to call down fire from heaven, and they would have been gone in a moment. Instead, he did not do that. He said, Father, forgive them, for they know not what they do. In other words, he was saying that they were ignorant of the things that they were saying as this statement is. When I lay down in my bed every single night and I ask God to send his angels to watch over and to protect and to keep my family safe from all hurt, harm, and danger, he does just that. When I get on an airplane, did I do not know how to fly. I could not even begin to be able to tell you what happens with the controls and all that. And I ask God to protect the pilot that's flying the plane and to protect the path that we're on. He does just that. And this is also what the scripture said about his shield being kept around us. He's our shield and our hiding place. He's our help and our shield. Those that trust in him, he is their help and their shield. He stores up sound wisdom for the upright and he is their shield. Those that walk uprightly, he's their shield. He's a shield to those that put their trust in him. I think that you get the picture. And I pray that after today that you take time to sit down and to open up the scriptures and to know what God's word truly says concerning him protecting us and keeping us. And even the thought that you believe that you have been your shield has only been by God's grace and mercy that he has kept you. I pray that you come to the truth and the knowledge of what God truly says in his word today.